Is British politics dominated by this tiny borough? Being accused of living here is sort of an insult. But everywhere you look this summer, on the left and on the right, it all leads back to Islington. Boris Johnson, he's the Prime Minister, a Latin-speaking man of the people. And this is the three and three quarter million pound Georgian house he used to live in, until recently. It's round the back of Angel Station in Islington and just down the road from Dominic Cummings. A man who certainly dislikes Islington types, by which perhaps he means the two local MPs. Emily Thornbury, the Shadow International Development Secretary, and Jeremy Corbyn, a backbench MP. It was in Islington that Tony Blair made an infamous deal with Gordon Brown. Blair would run for leader of the party, and Brown would, we presume, get blamed for the mess that was left behind. A deal's a deal. Tony lived in Islington, then in number 10, just like Boris. George Orwell lived in Islington, and so did Lenin, Heath Ledger and Cat Stevens. The media deride the idea of the Islington dinner party set, but I'd go for dinner with Lenin and Cat Stevens, if they ask me. Besides, all those journalists live here too. But despite their proximity to power, most people in Islington live on average shorter lives than their counterparts in Chelsea, and it's the sixth most deprived borough in London. Emily Thornbury was actually Tony Blair's neighbour. She was accused of sneering at the working class after this tweet in 2014. Her defence was that she was a victim of prejudices about Islington. Ed Miliband made her resign as Shadow Attorney General. The Islington set certainly exists, but they huddle close to Angel Station. They won't be seen in the giant Weatherspoons on Holloway Road. It used to be a Savoy cinema, and they're even less likely to be at an Arsenal match. But the next time a newspaper mentions the North London Metropolitan Elite, or the Islington set, or shames a socialist for his fairly modest home, just remember, they all send their kids to the same fucking school. Thank you.